Breaking news right now out of the nation's capital. The scheduled vote to repeal and replace Obamacare is now on hold. About an hour ago, President Trump had this to say. It's imploding and soon will explode. And it's not going to be pretty. So the Democrats don't want to see that. So they're going to reach out when they're ready. And whenever they're ready, we're ready. Sarah Donce has been following the developments on this and is live from the newsroom. Sarah. Yeah, Keith, a lot happened very quickly today. The vote was expected to take place this afternoon, but the bill was pulled at the last minute. And now politicians from both major parties are reacting to this news. Yeah. A Republican plan to end Obamacare undone today by Republicans. We came really close today, but we came up short. I spoke to the president just a little while ago, and I told him that the best thing I think to do is to pull this bill, and he agreed with that decision. Today, as time ran out, Republicans spent the day scrambling, knowing they were facing an uphill battle for votes. Today is a great day for our country. It's a victory. What happened on the floor is a victory for the American people. Ryan headed to the White House Friday to update the president. The vice president canceled a planned trip as some Republicans remained resistant despite two days of negotiations and compromise. The White House not casting blame for the bill's turbulent road, but certainly not accepting it, saying the timeline was not rushed. Has the team put everything out there? Have we left everything on the field? Absolutely. But at the end of the day, this isn't a dictatorship. Please vote no. The gentlelady's for time is expired. And soul. No. Frustration spilled over on the House floor. Mr. Speaker, I oppose this bill with every breath and every bone in my body. We must not give up. We have a marvelous opportunity, but we could lose it. I ask you all, and I urge you all, to please vote for this act. That opportunity gone, at least for now. Speaker Ryan says Obamacare will be around for the foreseeable future. So again, what happens next in Washington is really unclear at this point. Republican leaders are simply saying just that, that Obamacare will be sticking around at this point indefinitely. Keith and Lauren.